Welcome to the Profit Partners Podcast, brought to you by Better Refunds. I'm your host, David, and together we'll navigate the world of Amazon FBA and vendor reimbursements and beyond. Better Refunds is dedicated to helping Amazon FBA sellers and vendors maximize their profit recovery by recouping what's rightfully theirs through Amazon reimbursements. The Profit Partners Podcast is all about introducing our new partnerships. Each episode, we'll sit down with our new partners and learn what they can provide to help you with your Amazon business. Today's episode, I am honored in welcoming Nick Nichols as our special guest. What do you do for Amazonians? Everything regarding Amazon. So I work with a lot of brands across the spectrum to, you know, work to increase revenue growth, increase profitability, and increase market share as it pertains to Amazon worldwide. You know, how do you have, you know, basically high conversion, high sales with very little investment. So diving into all those various components and other components as well, to really take a brand from A to Z. So no matter where you are in that, what that sales life cycle on Amazon, you could be just starting off, you know, you, you, you have a product, you have a great idea, um, but you don't necessarily know the inner workings of how to actually get that from point A to point Z um, on the Amazon marketplace. How can you take a million dollar business or a $20 million business and turn it into a hundred million dollar business or a 1 billion business uh, on that marketplace? It's possible, but not very many, very, very many have um, really been able to do that and do that in a strategic way um, to drive growth. So my expertise and my experience really helps the brands with those type of ideas, with those type of products, really get from point A to point Z it's not all about, you know, doing what's best for your brand, but also doing what's best for your brand and being able to beat the competition along the way. That's how you take a hundred million dollar brand and then turn it into a one billion brand. I work with businesses um, that's as large as three hundred million dollars on Amazon, you know, that has over, you know, a twenty million dollar um, marketing budget. You know, some of those brands are spending, you know, one million dollars a month. And then you got some of those brands that are, you know, small and just starting out kind of what I alluded to earlier, you know, that are not so well known, that are just getting their foot in the water. You know what I call some of those little mom and pop type businesses, but there's never there's not going to be a, a marketplace out there where you're going to do as much sales velocity than that uh, Amazon. Why is that? Why is that that reason? Because Amazon has the most traffic out of all out of all the platforms. You can drive a lot of revenue on Amazon. So I have a lot of experience with brands that are have what we call that hybrid model, you know, driving revenue either on vendor or seller or doing a little bit of both. I've been in environments where, you know, a lot of different brands are just starting off. They have one product, they may have 10 products, or they may, I work with a brand, you know, that had over 150,000 SKUs on Amazon. And a lot of brands fall into what we call that 80 20 rule, you know, where you know, 20% of your hero products makes up about 80% of your sales. But my goal is how can you turn all of those products to hero products? How can you turn all of those products to tier one products? How you take a $50 million business and turn it into a $1 billion business. Some some brands haven't even thought that far away, but I, I, it's possible, but you got to make sure all your ducks is in the row and you got to drive, you got to work quickly, you got to work effectively, you got to work strategically, you got to work analytically, and you have to have a data-driven open mindset because Amazon is constantly changing day in and day out. I, I tell people all the time, Amazon is like, you know, walking into a dark room with a blindfold on. You got to try to get across to the other side of the room without bumping into anything, without hurting yourself. Now, let me ask you a question, Nick. What is your secret sauce? You know, what is what makes you run? You know, well, you know, for me, I wasn't fortunate to work with brands that just had everything good. Everything was all nice. It was just a beautiful day in Amazon. <laughs> um, a lot of the different brands I worked with, they had a lot of challenges and a lot had a lot of pain points. And what that taught me, that exposed me to a lot of the different challenges and pain points that brands go through day in and day out. But also, you know, how you take a $100 million business, take it up, you know, to a $1 billion business, you know, is because you, in the other part of that is increasing the market share, capitalizing and, you know, and, and outperforming the competition. What's the one tip you would give to, you know, Amazon sellers and vendors? <laughs> <laughs> I guess the, um, the advice that I, you know, I will give is you know, put your normal thinking to a side, you know, and think like Amazon. 